What's happening, everyone? Jay Shocklast here, and check it out. We have Raiko uh, in Mortal Kombat 1, and uh, this is his mastery card. Uh, this is the, I think, seventh character I've gotten all the way to level 35. This week, we are going to have Omni Man uh, coming to the game and a brand new season of Invasion. So it'll be very interesting to see what happens. But for now, this is his entire combat mastery card, along with every other item that he has in the game. Uh, rank one, you get this foreground. Uh, two, you get this palette. Three, you get this brutality. Four, you get a taunt. At five, you get a palette and a brutality. At six, you get this background for the combat card. At seven, the brutality. At eight, a taunt. At nine, you get this helmet, which is uh, kind of interesting. Uh, at 10, you get a palette and a brutality. 11, this combat card, foreground. Uh, taunt at 12. Some very useful character art at 13. At 14, like everybody else, you get his second fatality. And once again, I do remind you that you can use this fatality uh, the second fatality for any character at any time as long as you know uh, the, the button sequences. So just keep that in mind. There are definitely lots of articles that have them all listed on the internet. Uh, at 15, you get this palette, a brutality, and a combat card background. At 16, you get this kind of cool helmet. Uh, kind of reminds me of Peacemaker a little bit. Uh, I like it. Um, at 17, a taunt. 18 a palette and this is a, a newer kind of skin that you get and I like this one a lot actually um, at 19 another uh, cool helmet uh, he really has some cool gear at 20 uh, you've got a palette and 100 dragon crystals at 21 you have a combat card foreground 22 a taunt 23 another palette 24 some more character art yeah uh, another cool helmet and a taunt at 25, 26 another taunt, 27 a palette, 28 the background, 29 this kind of uh, Shao Kahn looking helmet which is pretty cool, uh, 30 you got the chibi foreground and another palette, 31 some more dragon crystals and a foreground, another foreground at 32 and a palette. Uh, palette, start getting the golden style ones, and a foreground at 33, 34, the palette, and the name background, and at 35, you've got the two golden palettes for each of his different skins, so pretty straightforward. Everybody has kind of a similar vibe, and uh, as you can see, we go into here, uh, Raiko, I've got a bunch of gear for him. Um, I honestly believe he has uh, some of the best gear in the game. Uh, some of this you could get in the uh, actual um, uh, the the shrine. He's got this kind of cool one. Uh, this is from story mode. Here's your character. I, I don't know. Actually, kind of looks like Orn uh, from uh, you know Aquaman's little brother. Uh, then you got this uh, right here, Dress to Kill. Rules of Engagement. Love this one. Like, this has got this, like, Roman Empire vibe. This one's from Story Mode. I feel like he's really, like, lucky and has some of the best gear in the game. And I do kind of wish that... Uh, you know, it was something that every character had the ability. Like, kind of, I feel like it's a step down from last game, uh, Mortal Kombat 11, where you could change a lot of looks. But there's also something about this that reminds me of like Triple H. Time to play the game. Yeah, dun 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 dun. dun. All right, it's my best Motorhead impression. Anyway, uh, with pallets, uh, so we've got 10 for each. Some of these did come from the seasonal store. We'll start with this one. I don't love this one, even though it does actually really look good. All right, 
<laughs> I don't like it, but it looks good. Um, it's it's a cool vibe. I'm just not into the whole uh, leather strap showing the abs, showing the man boobs, all that good stuff. Um, but love the Roman Gladiator vibe. Um, and it obviously says which ones come from character mastery and which ones uh, don't. <clears throat> like this one right here obviously came from the seasonal store, as did this one. And I do love those colors. Those colors work really well. So and there's the gold one from character mastery. I do like this one a lot more. And for a long time... Um, I actually was using this one because the only way you could get it was with the stuff from the store. Um, but man, these look good. I mean, this I feel like is just such a better looking uh, overall color scheme and everything for him. This is the one I think I was wearing for the longest time, but when you get the all gold, you, you kind of have to rock it. Then you got the kind of block the silver. And then, of course, you know, he's got all these different taunts. I wish you could actually preview them here. You know, like you can equip them, but then you just uh, wish you could actually press a button and, and see them. And then, of course, he's got, you know, all the, the finishers. So. All right. And then this this actual store ends in three days i believe so you know hurry up and get it while you can otherwise there's gonna be a whole new uh season two starting in three days uh so on the ninth i believe season of the specter will end and Ryko, we already saw everything but you know here you've got the uh the firebrand the ramble rouser ramble ramble the dri this one very much, uh, I don't know why, it just reminds me of Triple H, too. And uh, there you go. So, and some of the stuff you could get from the shrine as well. So, in any event, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, Raiko, from what I've seen, seems to be a character a lot of people like to use. Um, oops, did not mean to go there. Uh back to his fighter and I will say I got him all leveled up pretty quick uh, considering uh, how long it took Shang Tsung I did him I, I got this all done in, in about a day so anyway there's Raiko I hope you guys enjoyed we'll see ya